Ji Chang Wook is a Korean actor who rose to fame in the leading role in daily drama series Smile Again, followed by historical dramas. Then, in 2010, he did Healer, which increased his fame, which gave him opportunities to act in Chinese drama as well. Warrior Beak Dong Su follows the story of the legendary warrior Beak Dong Su. His group works to protect the king against a mysterious organization of assassins who are going after the him. Beak Dong Su and Yeo Wun are two friends that has been trained together to become great warrior of Joseon. Later, their way departed, become enemy to each other as they chose their own path by which one become the knight and the other one become an assassin. There is a heavy dose of political intrigue coveting the throne of the current king and eliminating the contenders for the throne. By Dong Su is played by Ji Chen Wook. Yeo Wun is played by Yu Sun Cho. Beak Dong Su's single sword and Yeo Wun's double swords flew many times in this series. Master Swords Man Wang Taik's finesse and Black Ninja Leader Chun's direct fighting were impactful. This epic historical drama centers on Empress Qi, once a nameless Goryeo born woman. She rises up social ranks after being taken to the Mongol Empire against her will and ends up marrying Yuan Dynasty. Emperor Ta Huan is portrayed by Chang Wuk. Ta Gan was the rightful heir to the throne, which was stolen from him by his half brother, who then exiled him to Koryo. To avoid being murdered, he plays dumb but he has a fierce rage and sadness within him. He eventually returns to Yuan and becomes emperor, and with the help of Song Ying, a royal maid servant, he becomes a dignified king and fights against those who are a threat to him. Keita tells the story of a bodyguard Ji Chang Wook who is dedicated to his country but is betrayed by it. When seeking revenge, he becomes involved with the woman Yuna who is the secret daughter of a presidential candidate. Kim Jiha Ji Changwook became a bodyguard at Sunder Choi Yu Jin's Song Yun A command. He was on the run before then. Accused and framed of murdering his fiancée, Renea, after interpreting an important and dangerous conversation. He was assigned to guard in Na Go Yuna, Park Se Jun Jo Sung Ha's daughter and Choi Yu Jin's stepdaughter. His code name is Healer and is equipped with wearable smart gadgets with senses and fighting skills like a beast. He is the best agent in the industry who can accomplish any tasks perfectly. His ultimate goal is to save up money to buy a deserted island in the South Pacific and live there alone. He meets Young Shin and his life starts to get entangled. He begins to take interest in the world that he once thought he had no feelings for. This is what people say love is. But the hidden truth of the past is revealed and that love starts to become dangerous. Park Min Young as reporter is strong-willed and queer internet news reporter at Someday News. Although less than perfect in reality, her dream is to become a legendary reporter like Oriana Fallacy. Her life becomes tiring because of rookie reporter Seo Young who would chase her around like a stalker. Suspicious Partner tells the story of an aspiring prosecutor named Yun Bong Hee, played by Nam Ji Hyun, who by fate meets No Ji Wook Ji Chang Wook on a subway. She falsely accuses him of getting handsy with her. Ji Wook heads to a restaurant or bar where he unfortunately bumps into her again, sitting at a nearby table. He overhears Bong Hee arguing with her boyfriend, who is cheating on her. This reminds Ji Wook of his ex girlfriend that betrayed him. Bong Hee then heads to her new job, where she is surprised to discover that Ji Wook is a prosecutor and actually her mentor and boss. Melting Me Softly is a romantic comedy about a variety show PD Ji Chang Wook and a part time worker Won Jin at a broadcast station who are involved in a project where Ethi are supposed to be frozen for 24 hours, but after something goes wrong, 
they instead wake up 20 years later. Ji Chang Wook plays Ma Dong Chan. He's a star PD who is great at his job and likes taking risks. He quickly jumps at the chance to be a part of the Frozen Human project. But he never could have guessed the experiment would go wrong and land him 20 years in the future. One Jin Ah is Go Mi Ran. Mi Ran is a struggling part time worker at Dong Chan's broadcast station and is known for being willing to participate in crazy stunts. Choi Dae Hai and Ji Chang Wook runs into a group of female high school students, including Yung Set Bile Kim Yu Yung, who look like troublemakers. Set Bile asks Dae Hai to buy them cigarettes from a convenience store. But he buys them candy instead and gives Set Bile his number. She never calls him. Three years later, Dae Hai runs a small convenience store after resigning. While looking for a part time worker to work the night shift at his convenience store, Young Set Bile applies for a part time position at Choi Dae Hyun's convenience store, which he also manages. There, their love story begins as they heal the wounds of the heart, gain love, and become adults dreaming of the future. Love is struck in the city is a romance about the dating lives of young people including a passionate architect Ji Chang Wook who meets a freelance marketer Kim Ji Won. Ji Chang Wook plays Park J Won. He is an architect who takes a long vacation to the beach to stay in a camper. There he meets a free-spirited woman who captures his heart and then destroys it. Kim Ji Won is Lee Yoon Oh. She is a freelance marketer who experiences some difficulties in life and decides to reinvent herself in a new city as a free-spirited woman. She falls for Park J1, but he falls in love with her fake identity which creates a big problem for her, 